afternoon, Cross Timbers. I'm Harley Brown, and welcome to this week's episode of Texan Sports Minute. In today's headlines, Tarleton basketball falls to the University of Texas, Texan runner advances to the NCAA championships, Tarleton volleyball brings home two LSC honors, and Tarleton football drops opening playoff game. The Tarleton's men's basketball team dropped their exhibition game against the University of Texas 95 to 61. This is the third time the teams have faced off, with Texas winning all three of the exhibition games. Texan seniors E.J. Reed and Charles Hill contributed 14 points each, while Malcolm Hamilton and Michael Harge combined for 21 points and 11 rebounds. Tarleton will officially start the regular season with a home game against Colorado, Colorado Springs, November 13th at 7 p.m. Cross-country runner Allie Coughlin qualified for the NCAA championships this past Saturday after finishing ninth at the South Central Regional Meet. Coughlin finished her 6K with a time of 21 minutes and 36 seconds, making her the second individual to advance to the NCAA championships from a non-qualifying team. This is the first Texan in school history to qualify for nationals as an individual. Coughlin is familiar with the championships as she competed in 2013 when the Texans made school history by becoming the first Tarleton team to qualify for the NCAA championships. This year's championships will be held November 21st in Joplin, Missouri. With a four-set win over Texas A&M Kingsville Saturday, the Texan volleyball team wrapped up their regular season at home undefeated for the first time since 1991. Haley Roberts earned her 17th double-double on the season with 13 kills and 12 digs, while middle blocker Kenya Alexander finished the game with 13 kills and 11 blocks. After defeating Texas A&M Commerce early on in the week, the Texans were able to take home two of the three weekly Lone Star Conference awards. This week, Gow and Alexander earned Setter of the Week and Defensive Player of the Week, respectively. Alexander averaged two blocks per set, putting her at number 20 in the nation on blocks per set. Gal was able to contribute 76 assists throughout the two games last week, which led to four different Texans earning double-figure kills. The Texans are currently ranked second in the South, in the South Central Regional Rankings, seated just behind Angelo State. The Tarleton football team fell to the Texas A&M Kingsville in the opening round of the Lone Star Conference playoffs, 43 to 25. Quarterback Zed Warner threw for 175 yards with two touchdowns and an interception after completing 12 of 27 attempts. Leonard Myers led the way for the receivers with 66 reception yards for two touchdowns. Jamarcus Durst had 18 tackles and Cody Bircher and Dakota Heskew contributed 11 apiece. The Texans, who are now 2-7 and seven on the season, will host Oklahoma Panhandle State Saturday, November 14th. That's it for this week's episode of Texan Sports Minute. Check back next week for sports news from Tarleton's campus and beyond.